If you were looking forward to The Mummy, The Invisible Man, The Wolfman, and Frankenstein and other classic monsters to show up on the big screen together, you might be a little bit disappointed as new reports have come out that Universal's Dark Universe is in grave danger. Now this exclusive report comes to us from The Hollywood Reporter in a new piece detailing the departure of Alex Kurtzman and Chris Morgan who are the architects of the entire Dark Universe, now certainly this version of it. Now according to their inside sources, their exclusive deal to produce the Dark Universe lapsed in September, and Alex Kurtzman decided to go focus on television as he's executive producing Star Trek Discovery and a number of other things for CBS, while Chris Morgan has returned to the Fast and Furious franchise, as he's writing the new spinoff for Dwayne Johnson and Jason Statham. Now, if you guys remember, in early October, Universal pulled the plug on production of The Bride of Frankenstein, which was set to begin in London. They were ready to begin rolling cameras but the studio felt that the script wasn't strong enough and it wasn't where they wanted it so they essentially halted production with no date in sight. They even pulled the release date which is never a good sign. Originally Angelina Jolie was attached to star as the Bride of Frankenstein but she has since now not attached. Now, all of this again points back to The Mummy's poor performance at the box office this June. The Tom Cruise movie grossed only $409 million worldwide on a budget of $125 million plus, as some insiders, according to them, put the budget considerably higher. And the marketing budget was also at least $100 million. You're talking about a $225 to $250 million movie that only grossed $400 worldwide, and a lot of that was internationally from China. You Universal also took a big financial hit as a lot of the Universal lot and offices were revamped to put together this new monster universe and now all of that area is sitting empty, which cost the studio a lot of money to put together. Now the president of production, Peter Kramer, said, quote, We've learned many lessons throughout the creative process on Dark Universe so far, and we are viewing these titles as filmmaker-driven vehicles, each with their own distinct vision. We're not going to rush to meet a release date, and we will move forward with these films when we feel they are the best versions of themselves. So apart from The Mummy, Universal has actually done really well at the box office this year. They've had $2 billion grosses in Despicable Me 3 and Fate of the Furious, and they had really big sleeper hits like Split and Get Out, which were both produced for under 15 million and made over 600 million worldwide. So really big hits there. Now as for the future of the Dark Universe, insiders at The Hollywood Reporter say that Universal will not abandon the monsters and will figure out a new way to put them together and course correct because with each new movie you get another shot. There's no way they're going to give up on this because this is Universal's legacy. So what do you guys think about this? Do, are you happy that they're abandoning this version of the Dark Universe? Were you a behind version that had Tom Cruise and Russell Crowe, Johnny Depp, Javier Bardem, etc? Or are you hoping for a different direction with the classic monsters. A lot of people were upset initially about this idea because they didn't really feel like an Avengers style team up movie could really work between monsters like this because it just didn't really make sense narratively or for their characters. I think the best course of action is to go for lower budget movies, focus on the actual horror aspect of these characters, and do things that are kind of standalone and not really focusing on whole shared universe thing and bringing them together, just focus on making good movies. But like I said, drop all your thoughts down in the comments below and for more updates on the Dark Universe if it ever happens, be sure to subscribe to Hybrid Network. Thanks again for checking out this video. If you want to get even more updates from us, check out our social media platforms, our website for the latest breaking news and editorials, and if you want to see our content get better, donate to us on Patreon and you can get exclusive rewards.